For all of you fitness junkies out there, or people who like to hack your own health with the latest gadgets, you've probably heard of Whoop and their Whoop Band. Big name athletes such as NBA player LeBron James, NFL quarterback Patrick Mahomes, and CrossFit phenom Katrin's David Daughter are a few among many who have supported the product. For those of you who have not heard of it, Whoop has a series of accessories, their most popular being a strap that you wear around your arm. The strap has a sensor that will tell you a lot of information about your body's strain, fitness level, recovery, and even sleep quality. Whoop derives much of this information from your heart rate variability, which measures the distance between your R to R waves. For the non-healthcare inclined out there, that is basically the distance from one heartbeat to the next. And when you compare subsequent heartbeats to the next, that's how you determine heart rate variability. This is done by calculating the root mean square of successive distances among heartbeats, but this is a bit more technical than I'd like to get into today. If you're interested, I can make another video on it. Let me know in the comments below. But as for HRV, what's the big deal? It turns out that HRV is a leading indicator of fitness and in health, as our heart's ability to handle stress originates from the central nervous system. The central nervous system, or more specifically your autonomic nervous system, is comprised of two parts. You have your fight or flight pathway, which is your sympathetic nervous system, and you have your rest or digest pathway, which is your parasympathetic nervous system. These two systems work in tandem and allow us to ramp up and hit the weights hard or slow down and rest and allow your body to recover. The HRV captures this battle. When your body is responsive to both pathways effectively, you have a higher HRV and you're more likely to perform at your best. But when our HRV is low, one pathway is overpowering another pathway and indicating that your body is trying to recover, you could possibly be fatigued, sick, and it's not a good time to Hulk smash. Since this information is valuable to determine if it's a good day to go hit the weights or if it's a good day to recover, Whoop is able to get a lot of people to subscribe to a $30 a month indefinite subscription. And you know how I feel about fees. Getting back to HRV, there are many factors that affect HRV, including lifestyle, biological factors, and training. So we can conclude this information is useful. And if you have a lot of money, it may be worthwhile to sign up for Whoop. But if you're like me and you want to save some money, then it really just costs a one-time fee of about $50 to $80 for a heart rate monitor, and then an app that can monitor that information for us. The heart rate monitor that I was able to find was the Polar H10, which I was able to get for about $50 on sale. Uh, but you don't need the Polar H10, you can even get their H9 or some of the older, later models. And this is a highly reliable, accurate, and a very precise heart rate monitor. Now for the software, uh, full credit to Elite HRV, which makes a free app which you're able to download and is compatible with a lot of different heart rate monitors out there. So I highly encourage you, look in the description below and look at Elite HRV's website of all the list of compatible heart rate monitors. Maybe from there you can find the least expensive option. And the best part is the Elite HRV is free and it's compatible with both iOS and Android devices. And this is how I was able to set up my polar strap with my Elite HRV. So there you have it, a one-time fee of about $50 to $80 depending on the sale of that heart rate monitor, and you're able to make your own WHOOP strap, which is able to tell you your HRV data, your fitness readiness score, all this information that you're able to get from the WHOOP band, but for just a one-time fee and without that nagging subscription cost. Now you can use that money you saved to invest, live financially free, and hopefully retire early. I hope you found this video helpful. Please smash the like button down below and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Thanks.